Right. Everything about that. Uh, I don't even rap. So what is this? K pop bitch, yeah. I'm already ready. Let's go with an ass potatoes. Welcome back to the channel, man. It's been a very long time since I've made a video on one of Jungkook's GCFs. Uh, this is actually the second one that I've seen, so hopefully, you know, this is fire just like the other one. I don't even remember what place he was in when I watched the other one. But if you guys want me to check the other one out on camera, let me know. If not, I'll just watch it on my own. But if you guys want to see what I think about them or whatever, let me know down below. Leave a like, blah, blah. Let's go ahead and jump right on in, though. Honestly, I want to let the film do most of the speaking. These films are basically short films films through Jungkook's eyes, you know, they're first person type of things. He shoots what he sees rather than shooting himself. I wish that they were like vlogs kind of, but like cinematic vlogs. So he includes like footage of himself doing things. I don't know. Let's see. Maybe other ones have them. Maybe they don't, but let's go ahead and jump right on in and bring the screen up for you guys. If you guys want to follow me on social media, feel free to do so. Patreon down below for exclusive content or whatever. Let's go ahead and see. I know that he's like American music or something. So let's hope we don't get striked or claimed or whatever. So this is from winter of 2020? Winter of 2020. 2020. The winter. It's January now. If we reach up as the waters bro, wait, wait. Jimin's hair was gray as well? Where have I been? Look at the mullet on RM, bro. Wait, this is definitely different than the one that I seen though the one that I seen I remember it being a little bit happy like the colors were more pastel and it wasn't so cinematic bro we start this off with straight mid shots you know shoulder up just personal shots beautiful bokeh you know flat picture profiles it looks like the colors are just very muted and flat this is sad GCF bro like winter feels so you're just gonna be sad bruh I, for, for one I didn't know that Jimin had gray hair maybe I'm tripping but the mother on arm is fire bro he's got them and I wonder if they like he told them hey bro lean back real quick or if he just caught them mid moment bro that'd be so beautiful bro that is such a sick shot look at him bro oh wait he does he has himself in he set a tripod up Bro, sugar, what the fuck, bro? You did your thing on Shadow Interlude, bro. You came to kill it with the fits, too. Dang, they all have these crispy coats. Where's Helsinki at? Is that Finland? Dog, look at J-Hope. Got a giraffe on the overcoat. Who has a giraffe on overcoats? Jen got the, the tie, the belt on it like it's a damn robe. Man, these are clean fits, dude. Oh, nice, dude. It's cold out here. I love how that shows that it's winter. You know, just that simple action. <laughs> it's like, we fighting, but it's okay though. Jimin won't smoke with everybody. Of course he does. <laughs> what the? <laughs> Jungkook, bro, you just took me out the mood, bro. I'm feeling the feels. I'm feeling emotional. You're just going to fade it to black and then sniffle? What the hell? What is he saying? What, did, what does that mean? Bro, the tones, sugar, you're fire, bro. <laughs> Chill out. Beautiful voice. He dyed the tail of his mullet purple? Where have I been? Dog, that's actually fire as hell, bro. Keep that mullet, bro. Wow. It was getting warmer. Well, now it's like sepia, like brown. The tones, the tones in these shots, bro. Oh, the sweater on oh, no. Yes, include yourself. Double G'd up. Yes, my guy. Who holding the camera, though? It's probably V. He changed the, the color to bars. Oh, my God. Nice record.
This song is beautiful, bro. Bro, the B-roll is nice, dude. He put us where he is, man. Now is he going home? It's on the airplane, right? I love how hazy it is. This whole video was very dreamlike. It's like he shot through a black promise filter and everything is just super, it's like, not so high in contrast. It's pretty muted. It's not super sharp. It's kind of like this whole video is a memory rather than it being like a film, very high quality, even though it is very high quality. It's gotta be beautiful, bro. Honestly, this whole moment right here is reminding me of like, he's with everybody. Oh, that was from the winter package. So he dropped that like for himself as a winter package item or something. You guys let me know. But what I was saying was that basically reminds me of when, you know, let's say this whole, like the situation, it makes me feel like everybody's on the plane. You know what I'm saying? They got their private jet or whatever. And then he wakes up for sunset, but not intentionally. He just woke up and everybody else, all the other members are sleeping and he lifts the blind. And as soon as he looks out, he sees that sunset over the clouds. And he's just like, that was a great time. And this is a beautiful sunset. And that was like a perfect way. Like that small thing was so beautiful. It just ended his trip with, you know, more beauty. And then he created that. I don't know, man. That was, that was very pleasing. That song was super emotional. That guy's voice was awesome. Who was that? Let me see. What's that song by? Talos to each his own is the name of the song. I heard him say to each his own. Fire, bro. What's sick also about them having like hobbies alongside their passion like this is... This man literally, he went on this trip. Are they in Finland again for Bon Voyage? I thought they were in like New Zealand. I don't know. But either way, it's like he took his time to shoot and film this, right? And then despite their busy schedules and all the stuff that's going on, he still edits these himself. Like that is crazy, bro. Like literally you see like content creators, uh, they'll they'll get past a certain point and then after that, they can't keep up with everything. So what do they do? They, they hire an editor, they pay the editor. And obviously BTS and K-pop groups even, you know, are much more busy than a YouTuber. I mean, honestly, I think that, you know, some people can get busy, but you know, I think that this is like different level busy. And he's still taking his time to create his art because he doesn't think that somebody else editing it will portray his vision, which is the way that it is. You know, you can have people do it, but it'll never be the same if you do it yourself or if you don't do it yourself. So that's a really cool thing. And that should make you like respect the guy more. That should make you appreciate the art some more. Um, the cinematography in here was beautiful. I really loved all the use of B-roll. I liked the way that he kept framing everybody on the, the right third of the frame and leaving the whole left just pure sky. I thought that, that was very beautiful. It really just locked focus on whoever he put on the camera. But honestly, that was fire as hell. You guys let me know what your favorite GCF is down below. And again, if you guys want me to watch more videos with you and make a video on watching the GCF then let me know down below which one I should watch hopefully you guys enjoyed this video enough to leave a like and a comment if you're new subscribe I hope you enjoyed this I'll catch you guys in the next video peace